Thank you all for joining me, and welcome back to Wrench Sim. So, um, this could possibly be the last episode for this season, uh, because we've got the update coming in June, and uh, I'll probably be come back to it when that update comes, because we'd have to do a fresh start, and then go from there. So, because there's not really much... I mean, it might not be the last one. It all depends on whether there's any small updates, any changes along the way, which is possible. So, yes, there might be some other updates, but just to give you a heads up. Uh, so, what I've done now, at the moment, I've uh, made a load of cheese. Oh, these are already ready. I've made a load of cheese. I've actually got a couple of uh, freezer boxes on there. There's actually one that's got 11 meatballs in it. Uh, so, I've, got, I've, I've already done one, ready to go. And... Yeah, and we've got a uh, 12 egg white mould cheese in there. And I've got a load of these, as you can see. Uh, I think we've got about four or five pigs that are nice and plump, ready to go. I did do some off-screen, as you can see. Uh, we've got some sausages and that here. So we're going to get that sorted now. Hold on a minute, what are these? These are, those are the white, I think they're white cheese and they're blue cheese, yeah. So that's for the blue cheese. So what I'm going to do is, this is for the sausages. Uh, I'm probably just going to make sausages here on in because I think that is, uh, um, yeah, I think they, you make more money on the sausages, to be honest with you, than you do on the actual meatballs, from what I remember. It's only like $10, something like that anyway. Uh, let's just take these in there, and then we're going to go and grab some. I've actually got the, I don't know if I got it in the last video, but I've got the stunner. Uh, the animal stunner gun thing and that is pretty cool uh, we do need to put this white cheese away as well don't we ready to go so let's drop these in here there we go it's easier just to grab one of these and just do it like this so they keep walking back and forth makes sense uh, there we go got that ready to go there's 12 in there that's the max you can put in there it doesn't matter what product you put in that's the max you can actually put in Oop. actually easy to go into a third person to actually try and get this lined up oh look at that perfect so we just need that one more wheat that one meatball in there we have actually got some pork here ready to go but i'm actually gonna fill up on uh more our uh, pork, shall I say. Right, so we've got 75% left to go for this. So uh, we need... That's the egg. That's the blue. Uh, yeah, so I need to go and get another... Yeah, we need to go and get another one. So I'll grab one of these. Go back into first person. Get one of these, and we will put that there. We'll grab these and put these in there. Out of the way. Ready to sell. And hopefully we'll make quite a bit of money today. Because uh, obviously I spent a lot of money on... I got some more feed. And I also uh, got a load of these, as you can see. <laughs> so yeah. Right, that's that. So I'll just leave that there for now. And then, because uh, hopefully these will be done. And I don't think they're all going to fit in there, the six. Oh, they will fit in there. Yeah, it's fine. We'll just leave that there for now. That's fine. So, here we go. This is the actual stun gun. I don't know whether I used it in the last video, like I mentioned. Now, I did use it off screen, so we're going to go and test that out. Well, I'll show you. It's actually pretty cool, because uh, you can actually hold the pig uh, by the rope. So you don't, Because usually when you've got the gun, you have to uh, ooh, let go um, of the actual pig. And then... You have to let go of the pig and then um yeah and then you have to run after it once you've actually got your gun out so the good thing about this you can just keep hold of it like this and then press your e button to grab the uh stun gun and then off you go what i might do though instead of bringing him all the way over there is bring the stun gun a bit closer yeah because otherwise I've got these five pigs to bring all the way over here. <laughs> uh, yeah. So we'll just do this one first. 
and then I'll go over and do the others. Might as well do them all. So if we do this here, oh, you stay there. Can I pick it up from here? There we go. And as you can see, we're still holding him. And then you do that. Why are you not working? There we go. Oh, I don't know if I have to do it. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Alright. But you don't have to do it once. Obviously not. So we'll grab these then. Grab one of these and then we'll pick these up. Well, I'll probably have better off going in third person for this. Go. Obviously, you can only fit 12 in, like I mentioned previously. There we go. I'll tell you what, this game is coming on nicely. I must admit, I do enjoy this game immensely. It is a, a really good game. Not there. Right, there is 12 in that in there, so we need to grab another one. Usually, if the actual pig, uh, if the pigs are uh, fully plump, then you will uh, get 26 pieces of meat, I believe. Something like that. There we go. So there's just two left over. So yeah. Yeah, that's 26 then, isn't it? So I'll just stick that on the top there. Let's, uh, tell you what, we'll just grab a piece of meat here. We'll put it in that one. Because there's actually 11 in that one. So we might as well just put that in there. And then what we'll do, grab this. Put that there. And I'm just going to put that there for now. I'm going to grab this. And we'll take it over here. Probably do it here. Yeah, we'll do it there, and I'll just go and grab a few uh, of the actual freezer things. And I'll start doing some cooking. Uh, what's this one? That's got one pork in it. Oh yeah, that's the one I put in, isn't it? Yeah, we'll grab that one. Uh, start taking these over, and then I can just bring them over then. Yeah, actually, what if I do it over here, out the way? Apparently, if you do it near the animals, it does frighten them a little bit. Bring this over here. Yeah, I think that's fine. We'll love to see what happens. <laughs> oh, dear. We'll have to see. So, there's a lot of back and forth at the moment, because I need to get this going. Uh, hold on. Well, that's 12. one have another one I think what I'll do I'll just do one more pig and then uh, we'll get some cooking and then off screen I'll do the rest that's probably gonna be the best bet otherwise it's just gonna be me going back and forth back and forth back and forth okay so I really can't wait for the uh, June update it's uh, looking promising I believe horses are coming in in the June update and obviously we're going to be able to build uh, buildings wherever we want I don't know whether what new buildings are going to be coming in I'll have to double check I don't think they mentioned they might have mentioned it I just probably forgot <laughs> more than likely right come on you all right we'll take you over to the shed over here and we'll have to see whether those cows get skitterish come on then over here Do we have to do this more than once? How many times do you have to do it? Shoot him. There we go. Well, the animals are okay. Look. Oh. Oh. He shit himself. Oops. <laughs> Oops. Right, okay. There we go. So we should get 26 out of this. Uh, where's that one with one in? There we go. So we'll get 11 in here. That's it. 
Then we'll get another 12 in here. And yeah, there's three left over because of, uh, yeah, there is. Because uh, we put that one in that, one that had 11 in it. Right, I'll just leave it at that, and then we're going to go and do some cooking, and then I'll sort out the rest of the pigs. <coughs> so I'm just going to be making sausages for now, and hopefully by the time we've done all the sausages, I mean, look at all this meat we've got, lovely. Oh, there's only three in there. Huh? Oh yeah, I put three in it, didn't I? Never mind. Uh, forget about it. Just ignore me. Ignore me. Right, let's get going. So, I should be... If I stand here, I can do that. That. Then pick one up. This is how I did it off screen. Can't put it in until that's done. And then we'll grab an egg. Place that in. But then we want to pick up by left-clicking rather than... If you do E to take products, then you'll make meatballs. Do that. Switch that on. Easy process. Here we go. We've got some sausages there. Oh, no, no, no. I didn't mean to do that. Oops. I can overflow. I've just wasted some meat there. Okay. Never mind. It is what it is. Okay. So, an egg. Go. Add product, pick up, put in, switch on, do that, off we go. Maybe I won't put the meat in until I've actually put the egg in and that. Just in case I do that, my bad mistake. I don't think it's done too soft. Oh, we need to switch that on. Might help. Handy that I can reach all the way over there. Go. Get an egg. Pick that up, that's it. I just had to work out what I was doing there. Awesome. Awesome. Now the um I was working out after the last video of how many cows it would take to actually <laughs> fit a light bulb. <laughs> I'm I'm joking. Uh that would actually um fill out fill one of the milk cans and it'll be six so if you've got six cows then you can milk them twice a day so you'd actually fill up two milk cans so yeah and then you'll get six cheeses from each of those so that'll be 12 cheeses a day so you could have six white and six blue so yeah that's awesome so that's what i'm saying but with the barn we've got now it would probably not make sense with all the pigs that you're going to need as well. Because it's going to be overcrowded. And they'll probably get stuck. I need mean, to do now. I mean, I had, what, eight pigs in there? And then now we've got three cows. We did have two prior to that. But, uh, yeah. All right, these sausages are coming out nicely. All right, we need to stick that in there. And there we go. And there, switch it on. The easy peasy. I mean, you can make a, a bunch of money off this, I'm telling you. Oh, I need to go and milk the cows. But right, I'm going to go and milk the cows. I'm going to get as much of this done as I can. Get all this done. And then I will be back. Just give me a second. Wow, that was a lot of work. And I still haven't finished yet. As you can see, we've only got three bags of food there. That's how long I've been going at it for. Um, I think I had about 20 bags at least there. As you can see, we've got all those up there. Filled that up. <laughs> Not as much as I thought we would get. And this is still all oh, got loads of uh, pork in there. I did some chicken as well. Chicken sausages. But I thought, well, <laughs> if I carried on with this, it's just going to take forever. So, let's go check out how much we're going to get from all this. Wow. Oh, I've got to reconnect that for some reason. Okay, so go this way shall we wow that was some hard work that was one hell of a grind and really what we got there one two three four five six seven eight nine oh hold on i missed one there i don't i think that's got pork in it 
Oh, that's another one we're poking. Wow. Off to the restaurant we go to see how much money we can make. But yeah, and I um, <clears throat> I saw a load of uh, roosters as well. Um, mainly because, oh, I've got through so much food with the chickens. It's just insane. Going back and forth. I mean, now I've got the trailer, I can get like uh, 20 food at a time. But obviously, with the amount of money we've got at the moment, I think I've got just over, I've got over a thousand now at the moment. But let's see how much we get with this. Hopefully, we'll get loads of money after all that hard work. Wow. That was insane. Insane. But the movement of your character just makes it very awkward to do. Well, oh. be there. Go. And I'm also going to sell some eggs because we've just I've got, I've got loads and loads of eggs. Uh, let's put these in here. I'm just going to put them all in there. Right, well, we've got cheese white mold, cheese blue mold, and pork. Oh, oh, I could have brought the pork with me. Uh, times two as well. Oh, maybe I should go back for the pork. Right, let's see how much money we we'll wait for this because I could sell the pork for times two. How much would the pork be anyway? I can't remember. I can't remember. I should have time to go back for the pork. Grab it all. I don't know whether I will or not. It takes ages to um, load the car up. That's for sure. All this in because we've got so many of these freezer things. They're all at the top there because I was hoping to fill all this up, but that didn't happen, did it? Nope. Alright. There, walk across here. Wow. That's just one hell of a grind. I don't mind a bit of grind, but sometimes the grind can get a bit too much. I mean, like on the infected, I mean, it's, it's a fun kind of grind. Not sure about this one yet. I've got to make my mind up on this one. Although some people think it's too grindy on the infected. I don't think it's too grindy on the infected. I have played some other games where it's just been so grindy you just end up giving up. Uh, and then if it's not grindy enough, it just gets boring. Basically. So uh, you've got to find that little, that medium. Of where you went. Oh, look at all that. 60,000. Holy moly. Right, the eggs, we've got well, it's at six. That's 106 eggs. Right. Okay, so the cheese, obviously that's two times. That's at 220 per. And that's six, so that's 1,300. Uh, yeah, and that's at 350. Pork sausages, 70. With an egg in it, it'll be 60 if it didn't have an egg in it. If I remember correctly. Oh, there's only four there, but 840 there because that's a full thingy. Right, what about... The chicken sausages, that's 66. That's not bad, you know. Oh, no, actually. No, that would be 70, so the chicken sausages, so the pork sausages are probably better. Yeah, I mean, I mean, it's only a $4 difference, but still, it'll be a lot better. And, uh, I mean, those are uh, the pork meatballs, are 50, so you're better off doing the actual pork sausage, to be honest with you. I'll probably just do all pork sausage. And then obviously the cheese is the where you make the most money from. I think the white ones, if you've got no egg in it, and it's just on normal, it's 100. I think. Or was that the blue? I can't remember. Yeah, so you would make 500 from one cheese mod pack. So yeah, wow, that's still all that. 236 items, wow. Sell all. 17,600, that's insane. Oh, a lot. That wasn't too bad then. About three or four days in game of doing all that. Now I've got to get all this on. So maybe maybe I won't sell the pork then. Maybe I won't sell the pork. Right, what I'm going to do is put this basket up here. See if I can just get this all in the trailer. Yeah, I'm going to get this all in the trailer. You can stack them anyway. Oh, this is going to take me a while. Okay. Well... That was interesting to see how much we're going to make from that. And I've still got loads of pork left. So I could go and get some more pigs. And then by the time I finish with that pork, I'll probably be able to 
made about 30,000 by the time those uh, the pigs were the next lot of pigs will be ready uh, that's pretty 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 good I'm pretty pleased with that a uh, bit of a grind that's for sure but you know have a, maybe they'll balance it out a bit more maybe they'll have uh, I don't know it'd be nice if you could hire people to work on your actual I mean I, well, we, we have got multiplayer but I don't know anyone that plays this uh, it's a shame because it'll be fun out playing it in, in multiplayer mode it would definitely be fun so I'm going to call it here then so uh, thank you for watching if you enjoyed the content don't forget to like subscribe and click that rusty bell to be informed of future videos and with that take care guys and I will see you in the next video